So this is how you can build a six channel homemade Christmas light controller. What we have is two four square boxes with um, three recepts and this is a switch recept combo. The switch is going to be what powers it on and off. And it's also going to be how we send five volts to the microcontroller circuit up there by just plugging a USB right into that. USB is five volts. Um, right here is the microcontroller that's going to be the brain. That's what you're going to program. You can build your own like this for very cheap or you can just buy an actual Arduino. And then I have a Sane Smart 8 relay module. These are 5 volt relays that can handle 10 amps on their contacts. So the microcontroller is going to fire those relays. So looking at the circuit here, here's the first four square box. 120 comes in. The neutral is going to tie to the neutral on all of the recepts. So don't break those tabs. Um, the ungrounded conductor, the 120, is going to go through a 10 amp slow burn fuse, inline fuse. It's on the inside of this box. And then to the switch, and that's it. When you turn that switch on, you're going to heat up the reset below it, right here. Feed 5 volts to the microcontroller circuit, and then you're going to put 120 at the common on all the relays. Which I just used a piece of din rail and some terminal strips to jumper the 120 to the common for all these guys. The ungrounded side of the recepts, or the hot, each one of those is going to be tied to a normally open contact so that when these guys close it's going to pass 120 to whichever recept you tell it to close. What's going to close these contacts are the relays. So here is the the microcontroller that you're going to program and you're going to tell it when to fire 5 volts to whichever relay it wants. When those relays become energized their contacts close and you got power to recepts. So that's pretty much how it works. Overall, if you wanted to build yourself very inexpensive in parts. And these green wires here are the same as these pink wires here. Those are the wires coming off of the controller going to the relays. So they come off of those pins and then energize whichever relay you want. So every time one of these red lights comes on, that's a different reset coming on.